You might notice lots of pink tomorrow. January 26th is National Wear It Pink Day. It encourages folks to wear the color pink in support of the cause of women's cancers. Zoe Mintz has been on the front line of this, raising money and watching her own mom face the challenge of breast cancer. This is something that certainly hit home in a personal way for you, and you've really taken on the challenge, not only for your mom, but for everyone who faces this. Yes, exactly. I find it's really important that more and more people know about this cause and not only about breast cancer which has affected my family but all women's cancers it's a powerful movement where everyone comes together with the shared passion to see an end to this disease last year uh, you raised uh, more than forty thousand dollars as part of uh, team rockstar which was kind of this initiative of yours to uh, to help th this cause yes um, well, after my mom was diagnosed with breast cancer, um, I thought I had to somehow turn this bad news into something positive. And uh, I thought the weekend was a great way to do that. So I asked my family and friends to join me, and they did. And we started this team, and through uh, the really generous donors and fundraising events, we raised over $43,000. And uh, we're really excited to walk again this year. How's your mom doing? We're looking at footage right now of the two of you. Uh, how's she doing? How's her health? Uh, she's doing great. She finished treatment uh, in November, and she's going to be walking with us this year, so we're really excited for that. Tell me what it was like when you found out uh, that she had been diagnosed with breast cancer. What went through your mind? Uh, the first thing, I couldn't believe it. My mom never catches a cold. Uh, she's always positive and never crossed our mind that something like this could happen to us. Uh, and you feel this overwhelming sense of helplessness and that's what kind of thrust me into these fundraising initiatives and uh, asking my family and friends to support me in this way so not only to help my mom in her fight but really all women because I realize that there's over 23,000 other women diagnosed with breast cancer this year alone that uh, need the same support that my mom does. Tomorrow is Wear It Pink Day uh, so basically for everybody out there who wants to sort of show a sign of self solidarity for this cause they can wear pink yeah it's all about wearing pink in support of uh, women and their families affected by women's cancers and also registering for Montreal's weekend in this August 2011 and uh, it's a great time to start your fundraising and it gives you something to look forward to this summer if people want more information they can go to the website which is triple w and cancer .ca, I believe uh, and uh, just a reminder that weekend to end women's cancers is the last weekend of August 27th uh, to 28th I yes. believe uh, of August I want to thank you very much for coming on oh, today thank you. all the best to you and to your mom mm -hmm. thank you and I appreciate it we'll be right back